Yankee Hall Division of the Ancient Order by burning the Durango State, State Parade Committee and the citizens of Durango and the surrounding environs. I send a heartfelt welcome to you and wish wonderful success to your life, Senator Hillary Clinton.
where a nation adopted a new faith without any violence. The only example, and I think it's appropriate that we remember that on the 10th anniversary of the Good Friday Accord. Hit go! One of the most meaningful experiences of my life is being able to do that. My Cassidy relatives, my mother's family, came from a little village called Roslee, which is on, it's in County Fermanagh in Northern Ireland, the southwesternmost county, right on the border of the Irish Republic. They were originally Scots-Irish, but they married so many Catholics, we can't tell what our roots are anymore. <laughs> so I was genetically prepared to make peace for Northern Ireland. <laughs> And I'm honored to be here because I'm grateful to the people of Pennsylvania for giving me a chance to serve as president twice. And because, as Tim Hogan said, when I was a young lawyer just fresh out of law school, my first important clients were coal miners who had been shafted out of their lifelong benefits by the rules of the government uh, in the Reagan years. And we changed the rules for miners all over America in the work we did. And I am grateful that ever since, Tim just reminded me, I'd almost if I'd forgotten that one of the last things I did as president was to try to improve benefits and prospects for miners with black lung. And now I just want to say this, you still have coal mining operations here. One of the most important things that we should be thinking about going forward is the obligation we all have to figure out how to burn coal cleanly. To do it, we're gonna to have to spend money and invest. I think we should invest it in the places that need it the most, in places like Pennsylvania, Kentucky, West Virginia, Ohio. We can prove Pennsylvania. that we can save the planet from global warming and burn a fuel that's gonna be burned in China and India and everywhere else anyway. We need to lead the world. If we led the world to the moon, we ought to be able to lead the world to clean coal. <laughs> Yeah, it's good. Yeah. 